considering you didn't get any running this morning, you must be pretty pleased with that effort in sprint qualifying. Uh, yeah, I am. Uh, I am because uh, qualifying has been the weak point for two races in a row at one point. China was a little bit better, but we didn't have the car to actually show that. And uh, on such a difficult weekend, because obviously uh, I, I did one lap in FP1, so I had to go in quali and uh, go uh, straight away flat out. We also had we are allowed to only use one set of tires in SQ1, so it was very, very tricky. But uh, straight away, I felt the feeling and uh, the hard work that I've done earlier in the season to try and make, put the tires in the right window have paid off. So I'm happy because there are so many talks now and uh, you are as good as your last race in this sport. And uh, obviously, uh, when you have two races in a row where you are bad in qualifying, which I uh, haven't done a great job, people start to talk. So it's good to, um, to stop that. But now, obviously, need to uh, to work in the consistency and uh, try to stay uh, at that level and put those tyres uh, consistently in the right window as I've done in the past. So good is your last race, your last performance. You've got the sprint tomorrow morning right alongside Max, but you've got a front row spot. What can you dream of tomorrow? RP1, uh, I have no idea about our race pace. We didn't do many, many oh, I mean, I did one lap again, so uh, uh, I have no idea about our race pace, but I, I really hope we can uh, uh, have a, a good sprint and um, and uh, and yeah, have a good race pace to uh, have hopes for the win on Sunday.